Hey everyone, this is Jason Ozzy Ash, and I am here to show you how I take care of my skin for a good LA Sunday fun day. So I'm gonna go through some of the products that I use and just how I keep my skin nice and clean. All right, let's take a look. So when I'm in the shower, I always do like a little pre-wash. Um, I am using my Fenty Skin. Uh, this is the Total Cleanser, so, which is really nice. Uh, but when I get in the mirror, I like to just kind of see what I'm doing. So I get my hands nice and wet. Use dime size. Yeah, I use dollar bill size. And I get in on the skin. I just, oh. And this feels so good. Oh Jesus. Oh God. And not a lot of guys, like when they do like wash their skin, like they skip their eyebrows, they skip their beard. No, I wash everything. I, I get everywhere. And now that I'm bald headed, I even get up right past that hairline a little bit and get up in there. And this feels really good. This is really nice and thick. And I don't use too much water as well. Um, Cause I want the product to get up in that skin. Growing up, pff, what the hell is skincare? I don't know what the hell is skincare is. So I would just go in the shower pff, pff, and that's it done. Come out, skin's still dry and dirty. And this feels good too. I like to massage my skin. It just makes it feel like I'm doing something as well and just moving things around. So we already see I'm massaging it so goddamn much. Ain't nothing left. So I get my same cloth and I get up in there and I do, do that. I don't, you know, scrub it. Just kind of pat it a little bit, rub a little bit. So after I do that, then I go ahead and I take that water and I get it up in there and just keep it nice and wet, keep it nice and dampy. Okay, water, you interrupted me. Then I take that same rag and I go in there again. It's like a whole process. It's an entire process to me. But it feels good. It feels good. It's nice and clean. Let me tell you something about learning about taking care of your skin. Every time I take care of my skin and do something new now, I think about how I used to take care of my skin back then. When I thought I was taking care of my skin, I would just take the towel and just, just go crazy. Just, just scraping everything off. Oh, Jesus. So I'm using this Fat Water by Fenty Skin. Let me tell you something about this. I mean, I've only had it for like two weeks. I love it. Pore Refining and Toner Serum. Really good. Really love this. I um, love a good toner. Again, I overuse products so much. And I go in, and I do it this way. Then I get in. Look at all this product I'm wasting. But I love it. And I get everywhere. All of this is my skin. All of this is my skin. So fellas out there with bald head, my head is now a part of my face. So I like to keep it all nice and clean and looking the same. When I was a teenager, I started paying attention to my skin. That's when it all started. Ooh, I had, ooh, I've had some fails. I would buy everything from the drugstore. If they said, this made your skin tight, this made the wrinkles go away, this made you clean skin, this, I used everything, I didn't care. I didn't care about mixing products, I didn't give a hell. I used everything, the cheapest stuff in the world. Uh, that started around 17 years old. <laughs> I guess when everybody starts realizing. I don't know. Just everyone starts feeling themselves, becoming more conceited. <laughs> Talking about you want to look good. So, joined the ballroom scene and started walking face. <laughs> this is the worst thing you could have told me at that time. Hey, you could walk face. <laughs> and I did that. And funny story. Went to Fashion Week with a bunch of my friends. We took a group picture. <laughs> I went home, looked at the picture. 
This right here was so light. I was so light and the rest of my body was whatever color it is. It was so much lighter because I was using so much bad stuff on my skin. I was using everything. So it was kind of like bleaching, bleaching my skin a bit. I was using at home microdermabrasions, at home um, chemical peels, at home everything. And oh, baby, the skin started saying, I'm gonna go ahead and just change your color. Look at how clean that is. Look at how nice it is. Mmm, so nice. So nice. What I do next, I use this um, Kiehl's Hydro Plumping Retexturizing Serum Concentrate. That's a lot of stuff. Um, this little pump thing here, which is really nice. So I just, I use like a pump and a half. And I get up in there, I don't rub it in too much in my hands. And I just go, place it around as even as possible. And I get up in there. You know, everyone has their own way of applying stuff. I have my own way. Again, I use everything on the beard too, so I don't skip anything. But everyone's like, do it this way, do it that way. Mm -mm, I don't like that. I go, and I just rub around, rub around. Rub around, get up in there. I gotta try in these corners here, here, and here. So, all of that. And I let these things kind of just, you know, soak into the skin a bit. What I do as well, the lips, I go ahead and I take any type of petroleum jelly or whatever thing you got, and I use so much, put it on my lips. Probably won't use all, that's a bit, that's, that's carrying a bit. So it looks crazy, but I'll just wipe this in the towel. I get it here, cause what this does, it looks, again, it looks crazy, but it just keeps my lips nice and soft. So time I'm ready to go, it'll be nice and smooth. Me a little mist. Get a good mist, it really doesn't matter what, well, it, it matters what brand you use, but Get you a nice one so this one here is a facial spray with aloe cucumber and green tea that just makes your skin feel good and nice and it just calms it down again i do the whole head feels good and yeah i kind of just let it just sit there for a bit so about maybe three minutes so yeah we're just gonna stay in here Pretty simple. It becomes simple when you understand your skin a little bit more. All the stuff I'm using right now is pretty light. Even there's a bunch of stuff I'm putting on, they're pretty light and it just keeps your skin throughout the day. Now we get to the moisturizer. One of the most important parts. So that's why I like to use a lot of things that has moisturizing things in it. So I use my Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream. And again, here we go, overusing product. I don't waste product, I use it. I remember before you would just use body lotion. Just growing up in the Caribbean, like we did skincare, what was that? Rub it around, go on the face, get it on the face, get it all up, and then I put it on my head as well. Same thing I do with the cleanser, it's the same thing I do with the moisturizer. Just get up in there and I just massage my face. Get up in there, massage my face. All over these packages, keep away from eyes. And here I am. Now that we're all walking around wearing masks in our faces, wipes all the products off. So I put extra and I walk with extra too. So um, I always get travel, travel stuff of everything that I use and I keep it in my car, I keep it in my bag, I keep one at home. Um, it gets expensive, but it's your skin, you want good skin, you know? So, you know, buy a car, you gotta put gas in it. I have not found a really good, lovely eye cream that I like. I don't know, I'm kind of convinced it doesn't work. So right now I'm testing out this, um, Age Defender Eye Repair by Kiehl's. I love Kiehl's. Why I like Kiehl's? Because you go in there, they test your skin, they tell you what's best for your skin. 
just a little sample right now i'm just testing so whatever you guys use please let me know put a little bit tiny bit put it here get under here just tap all of that and i'll just wipe the other one off oh god so ridiculous and i'll just go in there and i get up in there and i do that tap it in and yeah and guess what we're gonna do again missed missed I have three of these. And it's too slippery. I have three of these. Car, bag, home. Oh my god, he's wasting product. Got it. You didn't buy it. This just stole this from the esthetician. <laughs> and get massages in your face too. Get facials. Do all that good stuff. See how that is going away. Sometimes what I would do, I know a lot of men are still easing their way into this. I would take a little concealer, whatever concealer you like, Fenty Beauty. Got this little thing. I would do right here and right here. I would do right here and right here. And I get the line, that little line or what that line is called. <laughs> Now why we can't just do like skincare stuff and not have to make these like crazy little faces? Same thing here. I follow that line and that's it. And then that's done. A little back here. Tuck that in. Let me tell you, this right here is so relaxing. Having someone do it is even better. One of the final steps that I do, I gotta take care of my beard as well. I get some beard oil. You can get this beard oil from so many different places. Or you can use um, black Jamaican castor oil as well. So I use a little bit of beard oil on there. Get that in. Get it up in there. Oh God, I'm so rough. Don't do this at home. Get all of that up in there. Fellas, you gotta take care of your beard. Taking care of your beard is not just washing it and dyeing it and doing that. You gotta take care of it. Before I would use the same brush that I use for my hair, when I had hair, um, and I would brush that and I would brush this too. Something ain't right about that. So what I use now is my great friend's double sided club brush. It's super affordable. This side when I'm shaving, I would brush it off with the harder side, the firm side, and then I would use this side for my beard, which is really good this has been the most affordable but most effective brush that i've gotten because i would go to drugstores and i'd be like ten dollars for a brush god damn but this one again it is really affordable like seriously go check it up why buy youssef.com for his line so that's it. I know I look kind of oily and shiny right now, which I don't like to look, but this is for now. These products here, like, none of them are sold for like, this is for men, this is for women, this is for who, this is for that. It's skincare. You know, if it works for you, it works for you. Drink water, eat good. That's where great skin starts. That's it, guys. Um, take care of your skin.